Revelation 4046. From the 21st of May 1947. Will guarantees strength. What you are given as a task you must want to fulfill, then you will also receive the strength to be able to do it. And you must be aware at all times that you have a special task to fulfill which also requires a great deal of strength and therefore you must be in special grace, but this always requires your will. But the task assigned to you is in accordance with the will which God foresaw from eternity and therefore also shapes your earthly fate in such a way that it adapts to your task and your work for the kingdom of God will always be feasible in every situation you are placed into according to God's eternal will. Although it may sometimes seem as if your activity for the kingdom of God is impracticable, God knows about your will. He knows about the urgency of your activity for him in view of the great spiritual adversity, he has no other goal than to help people in this adversity, and anyone who wants to help him in this on earth he takes into his service and also assigns him his field of activity where he can be successfully active. If a person wants to work for God on earth then he will always be accepted as his laborer, as his servant who faithfully serves him and then he will also cover his path through life in such a way that the spiritual work will always result from the respective circumstances, as it is God's will. The human being need only trustingly hand himself over to his guidance and constantly remember his work. He must not become lukewarm and sluggish and pay tribute to the world when it entices him. But anyone who wants to serve God has lost the world's power over him and he will withstand its temptations because God will no longer let him fall who has offered himself to him for service, because his task is so tremendously important in the last days before the end. For people do not recognize God, and even the seekers often take the wrong path, the leaders and callers do not pay attention to them, and unspeakable amounts of strength are lost because they remain unused. Even the strength of the divine word is dissipated without finding the right vessel, which is provided open. And it is of particular urgency to place people in the blessing of the divine word, the word which is guided from above to earth by God's great love, which testifies to his power and glory and his exceeding love and wisdom, which gives notice of the eternal plan of salvation, of God's merciful love for the unredeemed. The knowledge of this is so important in the last days, for it gives man the strength to resist when the last test of faith is demanded of him. And to spread this divine word is the task of the one who wants to serve God on earth. And wherever his path takes him he will always have the opportunity to bring his word to people, for the strength of the word is indispensable for every individual because the last days require extraordinary strength if the human being is to persevere and remain faithful to God. And therefore God forms light and strength bearers for himself on earth. People who can receive his word directly and pass it on. And he will always give them the opportunity to work in his will because he knows the will of his servants on earth and will always bless them for their will. Amen.